Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Marvin again, back with some more music reactions. Welcome back to Smitty Reacts. Now, on this video, we're going to be checking out some more music from Elite Bata. Um, haven't checked them out in a while, and uh, this song came suggested a while ago. Uh, I believe it was uh, Eris that suggested this one in the comments, so thank you for suggesting the song. Definitely appreciate that. And um, the name of the song is called Linkser Wingy. Not sure what that means, but I'm definitely here to find out. <laughs> um, this is, of course, Elite, you know, saying the king of fingerstyle on the guitar here, man. So before I get into this thing, um, I also want to talk about, speaking of instruments, I made a post on um, Instagram not too long ago where I was talking about getting a uh, special instrument myself. Um, I actually got um, a bass guitar that was my dad's. Um, he passed away many years ago at this point, so, you know, it's fine. But it's it's been in the family. Uh, my little brother had it for a while. Then my little sister had it for a while. And then how, now at this point, I have it. <laughs> now, the only challenge with that guitar is, like, uh, it is broken. So at this point in time, I've actually taken it to a repair shop to have it fixed. So they said they're going to need a few weeks on it to do what they need to do to tune it up, get it in shape, so forth. But um, what I want to do... I don't know if I'll do this, but I, what I would want to do is maybe, you know, try to learn the, the bass. You know what I'm saying? Like, just to see if I can pull it off or not, you know. And that doesn't mean I'm going to bring it to the channel or anything like that. It doesn't mean I'm going to, like, you know, be on here hitting all the bad notes and trying to figure things out. Like, I'm, I'm not saying all that. But I might at least pull it up here every once in a while and, you know, just show it on camera and stuff like that. Like, yo, this is my dad's bass, da 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 So, <laughs> you know, I think it'd be kind of a cool thing to do, but... I also wanted to kind of share the story just since we're about to check out Mr. Aleep here, the king of fingerstyle playing. And who knows? Maybe if I watch him enough, some of his greatness will just rub off on me. And, you know, you never know. You never know. <laughs> so, all right, y'all. Enough of this. Let me go ahead and start on this thing. Of course, please. Like, comment, share, subscribe. All that good stuff. Host my little channel go over here. And let's check out Mr. Bata here and see what's going on with this video. Let's get it. Oh, that's really cool. That's cool. I like that. I like the way that he's like playing with the the. Uh, I don't know what those are called. See, that's why I need to learn how to play this thing. <laughs> you know, but he's basically playing with the tone. You know, what I'm saying where he's twisting the the knobs up top and so forth. I'm going to tell y'all something. If I'm looking about, if I'm thinking about uh, even possibly even pretending to want to play bass, I need to learn now um, what the parts of the instruments are. Because <laughs> this is a funny thing. I grew up around musical musical instruments. My family was there, is very musically inclined. You know, some play bass. Some My mom plays piano. Um, my brothers play different instruments. So those are my sisters. You know, all I did was pick up the singing and trombone. And I put trombone down when I was about, I don't know, in sixth grade or somewhere in there. But at any rate, I need to learn out the parts of an instrument. Just saying. But <laughs> that said, I, I definitely appreciate what he's doing here in terms of the tone and the way it sounds. Like, it sounds really neat. I don't know anything about this song. Because I know this um, Elite typically does, like, a lot of covers of, like, Western music and stuff. But I'm wondering if this is more of a traditional song, you know, from, from you know, where he's from. So I'm just kind of curious. Let me know down in the comments. But let me go ahead and rewind, and uh, we'll get back into it. Let's go. Mm. 
like I said, his tonality is fantastic on that guitar. It just sounds really good and clean. Um, and I'm assuming he's probably doing these done in other covers that I've seen of him, where he's taking the song and kind of transitioning it or, or recomposing it to to fit onto this acoustic instrument. And and that unto itself is like a talent. You know what I'm saying? It's, it really takes some talent to be able to do, um, you know, recompos- recomposing songs and, you know, making it fit, you know, on, on, a, on a platform where it wasn't necessarily intended to initially, uh, would be my guess. I'd have to hear the original version of this song to really be able to compare it and stuff, but I don't know some of you guys have already, or most of you have. So let me know if there's any big difference between, say, this version and the the, the other version of the song. Or is this an original song? Is this something that Aleep has done on his own? Now, let me know, too. I'm, I'm kind of curious. But that said, though, he's really doing a great job on this so far. It really sounds cool, and it's really kind of drawing you in, I, I, like... That's one thing I like about him and, and his playing style, is that it's it's a very stripped down sound. There's not no there's not a lot of overproduction or anything like that. He's really just him, a man, an instrument, and his skills. Like I love it. All right, let me go back and rewind it, and we'll get back in. Let's go. That's pretty neat, man. I don't know what the heck that is, but that's pretty neat. <laughs> I like that, that when he twists the knob on there too. You kind of get that kind of twangy kind of sound there. Bing, 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 and it really pulls that a sound out of that instrument. And you can kind of hear the note bend the way that he wants it to. Like that's really that's really cool right there, man. So give it up for Lee Bata, man. Definitely appreciate checking them out. And um, thanks to Eris for the suggestion as well. I appreciate that in the comment section. And uh, of course. Let me know what more stuff from Aleep I need to check out. Like, I know I've pinned a couple of comments here and there um, over the previous videos that I've checked out from him. And um, I try to go back and pin those comments for a reason. Um, honestly, just so if they have links to some of his other songs, I can go back and find them easily um, and get back to him as soon as I can, that kind of thing. But, um, you know, let me know below. Go ahead and drop some more Aleep Bata suggestions and stuff. I know he's got a huge catalog of stuff. I'll probably never touch the the surface of it i'll never scratch it but that doesn't mean i'm not going to try to drive a little deeper and see what he's able to do and of course the bounty's still out there for those that don't know i want to see elite bata and kakra khan do a song together <laughs> uh if they've done so like an actual song and not like a youtube version or collaboration on that level you know what i'm saying if they've really done a song together i want to check it out please and thank you please let me know if they have, and if they haven't, like, uh, keep bugging them, bug them, bug them, because I, I want to see it, <laughs> so, just a little something for myself, so, at any rate, hey, my name is Marvin, this is Smitty Reacts, I'm gonna get out of this video, so please, until the next one, take care of yourself, be kind to one another, and of course, if you guys can hear all that, or do that even, I'll catch you in the next video, all right, all right.